It's the big NCAA tournament matchup between the Texas A&M Corpus Christi Islanders men's basketball team and Alabama. Chris Six Sports Director Larissa Liska is live from Brewster Street Southside where Islander fans gather to watch the home team. Larissa, the big question, in case people missed it out there, how did the home team do against the Tide? Well, unfortunately, it was not the outcome we wanted to see. The Islanders fell to Alabama 96 to 75. But I tell you what, the fans stayed the entire time here at Brewster Street Southside. Over 400 fans throughout the entire game were in attendance today. And it was just a fun environment. You know, every time Alabama lost a play, you know, they were screaming every time Islanders made a shot. I know Owen D's early in the game. He made a huge three pointer and it closed the gap 19 to 15, but it just wasn't enough. And you know, you're talking about fans that are alumni. Even the mayor, Paulette Guajardo, was here. And then there was another fan who is a senior at Flower Bluff. She is an incoming freshman in the fall for the Islanders, and she's just so proud to be a part of this whole program. Let's take a look at what the fans had to say. I love it. Uh, my family's alumni here, and being here today is just an honor. It's really challenging for them, but for them to come up and do it and not give up, it's really inspiring. Literally, it means a lot to bring to bring the, the, the community and the university together and, and that to coalesce that relationship and that momentum. So hopefully we can build on that and create more that bond between the community and the university. That means a lot for, the, for us and for the university. Oh, you know, and it's, we're very proud. We're very proud of how our team is doing and has done. So go Islanders. A very proud moment. You know, a few days ago, the Islanders won their first NCAA tournament victory. 